10 biggest projects in Africa. After Asia, it is the world's second largest and second most populous continent. Africa covers approximately 30.3 million square kilometers, including neighboring islands, accounting for 6% of the Earth's total surface area and 20% of its land area. It is home to about 16% of the world's population, with 1.3 billion people as of 2018. Africa is expanding on a daily basis, and the emerging middle class is driving need for long-term social infrastructure. As countries across the continent struggle to develop infrastructure to support their fast-rising economies, work is presently ongoing on some of Africa's largest construction projects. Change occurs as a result of progress, and it manifests itself in a variety of ways. It frequently occurs in conjunction with new construction projects that encourage development, from school and hospital building to megaprojects that turn a region of a country into a megacity. According to United Nations forecasts, Africa's population could reach 2.4 billion people by 2050. However, that population's average age will be significantly lower than the rest of the world. This is referred to as the youth bulge. It means that Africa will have access to a large and dynamic workforce eager to establish a new future. Nations are investing in a variety of megaprojects in the hopes of sustaining this prosperity. Join us as we look at African countries and the construction projects that will help them develop. 10. Lekki Deep Seaport One of Western Africa's greatest infrastructural projects is being developed in the Ibiju Lekki axis of Lagos State. The Lekki Deep Seaport project is a $1.2 billion investment that will be completed in 2021. Lekki Deep Seaport a multi-purpose deep seaport at the heart of the Lagos Free Trade Zone will be one of West Africa's most modern ports, providing vital support to Nigeria's and the region's burgeoning commercial operations. The project management consultant for the multi-billion shilling Lekki Deep Seaport project is Louis Berger, one of the world's largest multidisciplinary infrastructure consulting organizations. 9. Konza Technology City Kenya's first smart city, which is being developed specifically to attract IT employees and investors, is already under construction as the government works to establish the African Silicon Savannah. Kansa will work to diversify Kenya's economic growth by establishing districts for business process outsourcing, disaster recovery centers, call centers, software development, data centers, light manufacturing industries, and research institutions, with a budget of $14.5 billion and a location 64 kilometers south of the capital Nairobi. By 2030, Kanza will have created 17,000 high-paying direct employment and 68,000 indirect jobs once it is fully operating. The Kenyan government is promoting the Kanza Technopolis as a business process outsourcing BPO initiative through the Kenya ICT Board. 8. Bagamoyo Port the ambitious Bagamoyo port is being created in Tanzania, together with 190 industries erected in a 1,700-hectare special economic zone adjacent to the port, thanks to collaboration between Tanzania, China, and Oman. With an initial expenditure of $11 billion, this mammoth project aims to become Africa's largest port, with the capacity to handle 20 million containers per year once completed in 2004-5. Tanzania will undoubtedly be positioned as a regional economic powerhouse as a result of this project. The project, together with its affiliated industrial zone, is expected to be the country's largest government infrastructure project. Its goal is to relieve congestion at the old port by replacing it with a leading shipping and logistics center. 7. Mombasa Nairobi Standard Gauge Railway Kenya will spend 326 billion shillings to build a 969-kilometer standard gauge railway connecting Mombasa and Malaba. This project is critical because freight presently accounts for only 5% of the country's shipping. But if completed, this new railway will help bring that percentage up to 40% by 2025. This new line will also reduce the time it takes to travel between the country's two most important cities from 9 hours to 4.5 hours. The rail line from Mombasa has made it as far as Maivasha. 6. Suez Canal Expansion 
The Suez Canal has been expanding since 2014, with a new shipping lane of 22 miles being built alongside the original 102-mile canal. This development, which is slated to be completed by 2023, is intended to increase yearly revenue by providing space for additional ships. Construction of a new city, New Ismailia City, an industrial zone, fish farms, the completion of the Technology Valley, the construction of seven new tunnels between Sinai and Ismailia and Port Said, the improvement of five existing ports and the digging of a new canal parallel to the Suez Canal were all part of the project. By allowing ships to sail in both directions at the same time for a larger stretch of the canal, the new canal has enhanced canal capacity. The initiative developed the canal cities into a major global commerce hub. It also established new logistic and ship servicing centers on the Suez Canal. The canal's annual revenues will rise from $5 billion to $12.5 billion, according to the project's administration. 5. Mambilla Hydroelectric Power Project Nigeria's government has finally invested to make the huge Mambilla hydroelectric power project a reality in order to meet the needs of the country's burgeoning economy and growing population. This $5.8 billion project, which has been in the works for three decades, will connect three dams across the Donga River in Taraba State, eventually generating 3,050 megawatt of energy. The project is being carried out by Nigeria's Federal Ministry of Power, Construction and Housing, with Chinese funding. Mambilla, Nigeria's largest power plant, is expected to begin operations in 2030, producing roughly 4.7 billion kilowatt hour of electricity per year. 4. Tuner Solar Park Tuner is creating a vast 4.5 gigawatt solar energy park in Tunisia covering an area three times the size of Manhattan, New York, and is leading the way into the future. This project will absorb energy straight from the Saharan sun and then send it via submarine cables to Malta, Italy, and France, powering up to 2 million European households. The two NUR solar project in Tunisia is a collaboration between NUR Energy, a UK-based solar plant developer, and a group of Maltese and Tunisian oil and gas investors. This project in particular requires a large land grab, 10,000 hectares, as well as a lot of water to clean and cool the panels in dry and semi-arid regions in order to export electricity to the UK and Europe. 3. Lagos-Calabar Railway The 1,400-kilometer Lagos-Calabar Railway, which is expected to cost $11 billion, is being lauded as one of Africa's most audacious projects. The rail project will go from Lagos in the west to Calabar in the east, passing through Port Harcourt, Uyo, and Aba. It will improve the movement of goods and services across the region once it is completed. Sable Lagos hopes to cover all seaports along those lines in the near future. The China Civil Engineering Construction Company is in charge of the railway project. 2. Dangate Oil Refinery Aleko Dangote, Africa's richest man, is developing a massive oil refinery in Nigeria's Ibiju Leki neighborhood on the outskirts of Lagos, at a cost of between $12 billion and $14 billion. When it opens in 2022, Dangote Oil Refinery will be one of the world's largest oil refineries capable of processing 650,000 barrels of crude per day. The refinery will produce Euro V quality gasoline and diesel, as well as jet fuel and polypropylene, and is estimated to create 9,500 direct and 25,000 indirect jobs. While Dangote secured a $3.3 billion syndicated loan from Standard Chartered PLC, the Dangote oil refinery will be self funded to the tune of 60%. 1. Grand Inga Dam. By far the largest building project in Africa is the Grand Inga Dam, a proposed hydroelectric dam at Inga Falls on the Congo River in the Democratic Republic of Congo. The dam is expected to produce 39,000 megawatt per year on average, about twice as much as China's Three Gorges Dam, making it the world's largest hydroelectric project. The cost of the Grand Inga Dam is predicted to be around $100 billion, not including the cost of transmission lines to transport the dam's power across the continent. 
By December 2016, the project was supposed to start. However, the World Bank withdrew its support in July of that year due to conflicts over the project. The future looks bright, it will also become much more brighter if we explore more innovative financing strategies. There is still a lot of efficiencies to harness in infrastructure financing in Africa. Stay connected to Africa Reloaded for more exciting adventures. Remember to like, share, comment and subscribe for more videos.